over one million people are about to be denied unemployment and COBRA benefits. Already 2,000 federal workers were furloughed without pay today. Construction projects are just coming to a screeching halt across the country. The suffering has just begun, right? My next guest respectfully challenged Senator Bunning on the Senate floor about this. Bunning's response was a four-letter word that I can't repeat on the tube. Uh, and joining me is that Democratic Senator from Oregon, Jeff Merkley. Mr. Merkley, good to have you with us tonight. Thanks, Ed. It's great to be with you. I is this the most heartless thing you've seen the Republicans do in the last year? How would you categorize this? Oh, it's it's unbelievable. It's uh, it's it's shocking from every perspective to take and say tough luck. That's the plight version to the American working families when they are down and out. When we are sitting here with record unemployment, I was back home this weekend. I was in a county with over 14% unemployment. It's next to a county with nearly 17% unemployment. I went down to Southern Oregon in Klamath County, nearly 13% unemployment. And here we have a Republican filibuster aimed at yeah. our workers, aimed at our seniors, aimed even at our small businesses. Well, where's the outcry from other Republicans? I mean, this is well, their guy. This is this. Their, they picked one guy to step up and be an obstructionist. I mean, this is a hell of a way to say to the rest of the folks in this country that you know what, we're just spending too much money. I mean, this is the jobs bill. I mean, it's not the jobs bill, but we've been talking about jobs all along, and now look what he's done to over half a million Americans. Well, and, and believe you me, we shouldn't view this as, as one Republican. This is a coordinated Republican attack on the American working You think family. it's a coordinated a, attack by Republicans? Absolutely. Here's, here's the thing. Others have to keep coming to the floor so Bunning can leave the floor. They did that last Thursday night, and they did it just a few minutes ago when I was on the floor. And uh, I'll tell you, uh, uh, this. I challenged uh, Senator Thune to come to the floor and end this filibuster now because he'd just given a speech about small businesses, yet this filibuster is cutting off small business lending to small businesses. So if you believe that, come to the floor. If you believe in support for working families, come to the floor, Republican leadership, and end this Republican filibuster, this Republican attack on our workers right now. 